Hey guys, it's been a long time since I've done an update. Um, this will be a really short one. Get your testing done, okay? So I can take this off since I'm in here and kind of unshaven today, and my apologies, but I've been in the hospital for a few days now, since Saturday, trying to work out GI issues. But exciting times ahead. We started new courses of treatment uh, a little week before last. Whew, that was rough. Um, and we got a lot more to go uh, to keep me kicking it down the road here for a little while longer. So that's kind of where I'm at right now. Um, and uh, I think we got the GI issues under control. I had an abdominal infection, so had to have some uh, uh, external devices that had become internal removed yesterday, and I will have them replaced at the end of the week. And hopefully we won't have to go through this again for at least another six or eight months. Um, so, uh, as far as the replacement goes and having an abdominal infection, it's no fun. Um, but other than that, please do get your tests. Know that people in my position and anybody that's battling cancer, even if it's a mild form, uh, the emotional wear and tear and the focus it takes off your life in places that it's needed, like where you want it to be, like your wife and your children and things like that, and your pets and your yard and your uh, your job and all those things that you normally do, it takes, it takes energy to keep those things up or you have to start taking away from some of them. That's really tough. You don't wanna be here. So I'm gonna show you something. I'm gonna try to edit this later where right up here, bing, you're gonna see a list and you can pause this video and look through it and it'll tell you on that paper, if I'm able to get this done, what tests you need for cancers and when in your life you need to have them. Do it, please.